good. Now we're all set. Lunch is on me today, Frank, my friend. So I hope you brought um, Could have, probably should have got more cheese. Do you want to shoot next door and get a bagel or something? I think I already got kind of enough for two. I mean two, two for me, one, and none for you. So, <clears throat> toasted sandwich is uh, David Green style. What we're making today in the kitchen. Something I prepared earlier. Um, turn on the grill. If you want to make this at home, all you need some white toast or bread and uh, enough cheese for as many people as you're serving. And uh, the secret ingredient tomato sauce. I like to uh, use these, just the standard tray that comes in the oven. So I don't really have any other tray. If you're ever um, doing, making this yourself, don't um, do it without the tomato sauce. It's not as good. Ooh, it's eating up. Looking ready? Ooh. There we go. You can tell when they're ready by the, the slight curvature of the bread. Mm -mm. Don't know what you're missing out on. Probably got a pretty good idea of what you're missing out on. Ooh. Watch out. Don't try and eat them. Have your bagel. You know, you, I know you want it now. You were skeptical. <laughs> now that I've said it, you're thinking, well, cream cheese. Like cream cheese? Yeah, I can see it. Ooh. Can cut uh, either the long way or the short way. Boy, there really is not enough for two people. I don't know what I'm going to do about this stupid interview. I know what it'll be about. All these like supposedly, you know, things I have in the show, supposedly stupid things that I've done. Oh. Still looks good. Point a camera at someone for long enough and like, put them, like push them into like idiotic situations. I'm not an idiot, but pu push me. I'm going to do something stupid. But then don't, you know, why do we have to drag it through the mud? Sheesh. What's the matter? Cameron. Has he been in an accident? No. Nice way to ask. Well, what's wrong? If 
you know, you were thinking of reasons. Mm. Probably nothing, to, nothing at all to do with the like, you know, the kiss thing. No. Because the yeah, it was no. a, totally not. No. So like, and why why would it be? It's all just water under the bridge. He's all right with it, and you're nothing going on between us. No, he's over that. Good, good. I'm just... You're not listening to me. Yeah. I'm no, I'm listening. listening. No, we said that it's not nothing to do with the kiss. It's trying to rule out, you know, for your own happiness. Yeah, I know, but I don't know what it is. Well... <laughs> you know... Distant. Hmm. Shame, really. Shame. If you know something happened, because you you're good together. Would it help you to like hang out with me today? Yeah. yeah. Probably. You just wanna. You just want me to be around. Yeah. You're not alone. No. <laughs> not all alone. No, I don't want to be alone. Let me just make a phone call. Come in, I think you love to be alone. Okay. Hey, Roger, it's David. Um, oh, well, yeah, not doing that good, actually. Got some bad news. Unfortunately, something's come up. It's completely unexpected. And, uh, what it means is that I won't be able to follow through and um, do this interview this afternoon. Well, um, a friend of mine, a you know, very dear friend, has come around and um, she's having problems with her boyfriend and is requesting that I'm you know, here for her in her moment of need. No, well, normally I, w I would agree with you, but she's being very insistent that she wants me to be around for her, and she's requesting that we go to a movie, so... Yeah, no, no, it's not, it's not a ruse. What? No. I know I have in the past, but... Well, no, do you want me to go in there now? And I can, you can listen to a sad girl crying if they'll prove that it's not a ruse to you. Right. So, no, I am, I am sorry. So, yes, if anything comes up, then I'll, I'll ring you and I'm just saying, don't, just don't hold your breath. But I am sorry, so. All right, I will. Okay, sorry, Roger. Bye. Frank, what are you doing here? I don't understand this. I don't know why you're lurking around my house, just waiting any chance to film. Find a life for yourself. I've got one. I'm gonna see Andy, I'm gonna hang out with him, talk about his show, talk about my show. This is the first real day off I've had since we started this.
I'm looking forward to it. Not even a full day because, you know, the sun's almost gone, but... Look, your Roger, you heard me on the phone, your boss, my boss, told us to take the day off. Because, you know, babysit Maria. I can't help it if she got a call from Cameron, you know, and uh, now she's with him. Can I help that? No. I said, Maria, c can you stay? Because I want to I wanna be the one to look after you. But, you know. Anyway, I'm going to go see Andy. Just quit lurking and go home. Frank. You know the other day after I went to like see Andy and um, you know we were hanging out and like I was all excited because like it's the first time I've seen him since we got signed for the show and you know he's excited as well because he's like got his his stage show coming up and he's like oh we're going on about it and I'm like oh yeah cool that sounds good and then I'm like, oh, you want to have a look at this? I like, have a look at the, um, like, the review, like, the focus group, like, notes from, like, from our show. And I'm, like, showing him stuff. And he's, like, just going through and he's, like, picking out all the, like, all the bad bits. Like, oh, David's, uh, David's boring. Um, not a lot happens. And he's going on, like, oh, you know, he writes his his show and like he's figured out the jokes and stuff and um and you know maybe i should like write oh I'll just write some jokes for your show dave i can write you some jokes then like might spice it up and like my show's not it's not a comedy it's not like it's like real life it's like human drama and like me doing stuff and he's like well i don't see how people are gonna like want to watch it if it's just you know if nothing's going on. I'm like, well, I'm fucking not, nothing's going on. I'm doing stuff. And like, you know, I just kind of like lost it. And I'm like, you know, fucking, fucking be supportive of my shit. And, and, you know, stop saying I'm boring. Stop, you know. And like going off on him, he's just like standing there, just like, you know, like a statue, like Easter Island kind of. Mm, like nothing to say and like why would he because he's got like nothing there's no comeback to it because it's all like no valid points to, to come back with and so like you know I'm blah and then I'm like have you got anything to say and he's just like looking at me and then says nothing so I'm like all right and I just like left fuck you and I just left came home and just but I just can't stop, can't get it out of my head now. You know, that, like, that he can't, can't be supportive of, of what I'm doing. And doesn't think, thinks that it's boring. Thinks that, you know, the show is empty. So, you know, if the show is empty, it's because um, so, I'm just, I've, I've decided I just, I'm not talking to him. I'm not gonna, if he's not supporting me in my show, then I'm not gonna talk to him, and I'm not gonna support him in his show, to be honest. Um, so I'm not talking to him, and um, I'm not gonna go to his show. Um, And that's it. Da 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 da. Ta da!
Oh, 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 I killed all the flats. You know, he wasn't actually acting suspiciously. He just, you know, he didn't want to ruin the surprise. It's quite a big thing. Well, Key to the flat. It that says was something. a surprise. It was very surprising. Say something. You know. It's a signal. What are you doing? It's the... Ooh. Sorry, it's the... It's the what? The ink from the pen. It's giving me a kind of a rash thing. Down there. I mean, can you just not, just like, not do that in front of me? I'm going to have to see a doctor or something. Yeah, well, until then, just restrain yourself. So crotch boy. Have you seen Andy recently? Not in a while, no. Are you still mad at him? Yeah, I suppose. I don't think he said those things to hurt you. I really don't. His show's coming up, are you gonna come see it? Crutch boy. Mm. <laughs> yeah, shoulders okay. Hey, it's a No! Yuck! Keep it away! Oh, <laughs> ah, chance! <laughs> I hope that doesn't catch on. <laughs> Mr. Green? Yeah, let's uh, not drag this out any longer than it needs to be. No, I won't sleep with you. Is Andy in tonight or is he not in tonight? Do you see him? No, but I haven't checked everywhere. He could be upstairs. I'll just have a look. No, he's not in there. Oh, it's his day off. All right. Yeah, as, as any good friend of Andy's would know. Right. Now, when days, when, Wednesdays are generally his day off. Must have changed. As it has but been either way, the week before. He is not in, so. Well, no. I am not in. But when he's here, he's here. Yes, okay. But when he's not, he's not. Bye. Is it, uh, is it because he's not talking to you? Is that the problem? No. I'm not talking to him, Mr. I think I know what the story is, so. Well, well, I'm talking to him, and he told me he's not talking to you. What do you mean? What do you mean? Well, I mean that he's not talking to you. It's not really for me to say. Yeah, but that's why you kept it to yourself. To yeah. Good work with yeah. that. Well, see, I don't want to confuse you, but see, he's not talking to you. I'm talking to you. Did he tell you that, that he's not talking to me? Well, have you heard from him? No, because I've not been Therefore, talking to him. I said, you know, excuse my French on the camera, but if you. Yeah. And then I left and I said, I'm not going to talk to him. And, and you know, because I'm angry. To not to him, because I'm not talking and, to and him. And what did he say to you? Well, he finally said nothing. Because he stopped talking to you a sentence before you stopped talking to him. See, he already stopped talking to you by the time you said "if you" and left. He had already stopped talking to you before you'd even said what you said. This is turning into a bunch of he said, he said. Well, he did say. Well, he didn't say it to you because he's not talking to you. He told me. I don't. I don't get it. Because if he's he's not talking to me, then it completely negates me not talking to him. He hasn't learned anything. Yeah, you'd be right there, yeah. Well, I'll see you, I'll see you about that. I don't be disheartened. Um, a movie came in here. What movie? A Christmas Carol. Oh, you're dreaming of a white Christmas.
to the bottom of this. So. So what? So, we were just at the video store. I was talking to Justin. He tells me you're not talking to me. No, that's right. I'm, I'm not talking to you, no. But I'm not talking to you. No, I'm the one who's not talking to you. Well, for the last few weeks, I've not been talking to you. And you and haven't heard from me, sudden, so I'm not talking to you. But that's because I haven't been talking to you. So how would I know if you're not talking to me if I'm not talking to you? Because I haven't talked to you for you to talk to me. This is apparently what Justin's story is. He tells me some mumbo guffo about... You stopped talking to me a sentence before I stopped talking to you. How you knew that, I don't know. Yeah, well, that's amazing. the thing, you know, you know how I, I told you what I thought of the review, yeah. and then you told me what you thought of me, right? And you know when well, you go like this, right? And you're talking away, going, going off at me, right then I stopped talking to you. But and therefore, yeah. I'm not talking to you because I stopped talking first. I have to be Christian to know that. How did you know that I was going to not... I was going to stop talking to you then. What? Yeah, but the point is, I'm, I'm just not talking to you. But That's the whole thing. But I was just talking to Justin. And I was just talking to Justin, and we were both just winding you up. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, that was classic. Come on, man, it's cold. Fucking Roger, are you shooting? We gotta be shooting if it's Roger, are you shooting? I'm always shooting. Alright, good, good, good. Hey Roger, it's David here. Yeah, just uh, out and about shooting with Frank, so no need to worry about that if that's why you're calling. <sighs> why is that? What? Well, it's a bit out of the blue, isn't it? I mean, we... Well, I know I've, I've been... I wouldn't say lazy. I'd say, I mean, I'm, maybe I've been a little bit relaxed about shooting, but, I mean, there's two sides to every story. There's my side. There's Maria's side. She was genuinely upset. It wasn't a ruse, Roger. I don't know how to convince you of this any more than they have. And plus there's Frank's side, that's the third side, he's got his family to think about. I know he's not married, but he's got parents. What? Sorry, I was trying to think of a fourth side to that. Look, let's not make any hasty decisions. I can, I can come in, I can talk to you, it doesn't have to be with Frank. We can sit down. <sighs> Look, I mean, I don't want to be rude about this. But I, do you even have the authority to do this? So do, can, let me come in. I can sit down with you. We can talk to Bill. Hey, Bill. Yeah, no, I, I, I didn't know you were there. Yep. Okay. Well, obviously, I'm not happy about it, but... All right. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Well, thanks for calling. Bye. Fuck. Just take five, Frank. He's going to kill me. Jeez. Oh. oh fuck. Oh fuck, 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 fuck. Oh. Um, 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 um. Hey man. Just keep chilling, man. It's cold, just 
shoot some shots of the trees if you want. It's all good. What's going on, David? <sighs> Just having a few problems with Roger. Ah, uh, he'll sort himself out. <laughs> he's just like ringing up with, you know, these d hasty decisions he's made and doesn't seem to talk to anyone involved. <laughs> oh well. We don't have a show, do we, David? Sit down if you... Don't loom over me if you're not going to film stuff. It's not even entirely necessary to shoot this. We don't have a show, do we, David? I don't want to say no show. I mean, we shot, we've shot a lot of stuff, um, but they probably don't want to put it on TV anymore. So we don't have a show? There's, you know, Roger, there's, there's always wiggle room in these situations. They come, it's offer, counter offer, they come to you with the thing, maybe they don't want to do it anymore, you come back, let's, let's keep doing it. Um, David, we don't have a show. Lots of people don't have shows, that doesn't mean that... Maybe, maybe not. Give me the mic, David. Do it, Frank. Give me, give me the mic. Just sit down. Just give and me the mic. And we can keep talking about this. We can figure out what we're gonna do. Give me the mic. Frank. Oh fuck! It's... This wasn't my decision, Frank. They bring up with. Call me, Fr Frank. Frank. 